Darlene Ron, as fires continue to burn across the state, one area that fire crews are focusing on is the Bosque. They're using tools like airboats to patrol along the river. Bosque fires are not uncommon, and with the drought in our state, it's an even bigger concern. But Bernal County is trying to make a proactive approach to protect our bosque and make sure that there aren't any incidents during these severe conditions. One thing they look for are burn pits. People are lighting fires in the bosque with the dry conditions. They leave the fire unattended and then it turns into a large incident for us. He says doing patrols early makes a big difference if there is a fire. If there is a, an event in the bosque, we're readily available. We're already on the water to try and mitigate that situation at its infancy stage. If there is a situation similar to what we saw a few weeks ago in Valencia County, all the departments are ready. We have water tenders to bring water to the fire. We have pumps that we're able to put into the river to extinguish the fire. But it's a whole metro effort to prevent any incident like this. Aside from fire patrol, they're also emphasizing water safety and some of the things that you can encounter while being out in the bosque. This is one of the examples that they gave me. These are metal structures called jetty jacks. These are meant for flood control and actually run under the river. They tell me that this is one of the things that people can get stuck on if they're not careful. Reporting live in the bosque, Stephanie Muniz, KYT Action 7 News. Stephanie, thank you. Bernalillo County Fire will be partnering with other departments on May 21st to have a public safety water day at several locations across the bosque.